So how high do you fill your pots? Well, not all the way to the top. You don't really need all that grow mix. These are my 15 gallon bags here. I fill them about, they look about half in this particular case. I'll probably put more in it once I put the tomatoes in. Uh, I have it not quite as high as I want to right now because it's easier to plant the tomatoes deep if you don't have as much soil in there, but I will put some uh, put some more compost in there to raise them up. But you don't definitely don't want to fill it all the way to the top. You don't need all of that. Also, the, the wall that's formed by the upside or, or, or the area that's not filled does provide a little bit of a windbreak for the new seedlings when you put them in there. And on a day like today where the wind is, you, know, you can see the plants moving over there, it, uh, it provides a little bit of an advantage, not a huge advantage, but you definitely have some advantage. And, when, you know, I don't have my, my supports up yet for some of these tomatoes, which are ready to have supports. So you want to make sure that you have every advantage that you can you can always add more soil, soil if you if you need it, but I wouldn't start out putting, you know, definitely, it, it, mine never will get all the way to the top. It also gives me space so that I can put in some pine straw as a, a mulch to help pre prevent evaporation and keep the soil moist, um, but it also helps, you know, the, the soil can still breathe when it's pine mulch. I don't put leaves and things like it in, in there for a compost because they tend to compact too much and it can really affect how well the the soil can breathe so don't fill them all the way to the top this is a 15 gallon one i like doing the 15 gallon ones for tomatoes you could do a 10 gallon one for tomato if you filled it up more but this allows me to also plant some companion plants in here and every one of these these particular larger pots like this not so much the smaller pots this is i think a 10 gallon one i can plant one or two small basil globe basil plants maybe even a couple bush beans in here and those are what's called companion planting, and they can actually help grow or help your, with your growing. For some reason, tomatoes like basil, and uh, they grow better. And I think it has something to do with the, the chemical scent. The basil will, will you know, uh, insects will t smell it and don't really like it except for bees, and so they'll stay away from it. Whatever reason, they tend to go well, and, and you can use the same pot to grow both. As far as beans go... Uh, everything like beans, because beans produce nitrogen in the soil because of the, the bacteria that, that tend to like to hang out and form little apartment complexes in the roots of these legumes. So yeah, don't fill your pots all the way up. Just fill them about two-thirds of the way by the time you're finally done filling, and then you want to make sure that you, you use some kind of comp, uh, mulch on the top so that you, you know, you're, they're not drying out quickly. And they will. They'll dry out real quickly if you don't.